is just in. August is hotter than ever at Appalachian Wireless as they are slashing all normal contract pricing on all smartphones by 50% when you sign up for service. Better service, bigger savings. Serving you for the last 25 years at Appalachian Wireless. Founded in 1999, Judy's Place for Kids, named after Kentucky's former First Lady, Judy Patton, have been helping approximately 300 abused children every year in Pike, Floyd, Johnson, Martin, and McGoffin counties all receive the essential services necessary to help them heal and prevent abuse. It takes the support of many communities to help Judy's Place provide these services, and that help came this weekend with a two-day event organized by Trinity Harvest Church in Pikeville. The church kicked things off Friday with a free community block party. Last year I think they helped almost 300 people. Um, that's 300 too many for our area. So we decided we, need, we want to give back. We want to help them in their mission of helping children. So at Trinity that's what we're about. We're about loving Pikeville. So what better way than a block party? It's a beautiful evening. We have free hot dogs. We have Batman. We have the Disney princesses. We made this night special with a ton of sponsors and their help. And we're just really excited to invite the community in out back and just have a party. The community of Pikeville really came out in support of Judy's Place for Kids Friday. Even Batman pitched in and done his part. We're here supporting the block party, so I wanted to come down here to Trinity Harvest Church, support the community, give our message. But the main theme is we're also trying to raise money for Judy's Place. I was abused as a kid. I went through some traumatic abuse from 12 to 14 years old. Sent me down, spiraled me out of control into drugs and dropping out and all kinds of a mess. Eventually though, life turned around for me by the grace of God. So now, I'm here to inspire people to take pain in their life and turn it into power. And then on top of that, we're selling some of my Batman posters and giving the money back to uh, Judy's Place. In day two of this weekend's events for Judy's Place for Kids, nearly 100 people put on their running shoes for the Impact 5K. Officials with Judy's Place say they are truly grateful for those who support them in their mission. Events like this help get the word out about the work that we do at Judy's Place for Kids. They help us bring in funds that help us provide services to children every day. And so we're very thankful that over the years organizations like this uh, and other groups have raised funds on our behalf and have gotten involved. It helps them know more about what we do and really makes a difference in providing services to children. The winner of the Impact 5K took home more than just a medal and a runner's tan. He won a trip to the house the mouse built. I'm tired. It's, it's hot. I feel great though. It's a good race. They have good people here in pot will put on good events. Because I want to thank God above. He's, it's, if, if I, I'm 43 year old and I can do what I do, thanks to God above. I'm going to Disney World! For more information on Judy's Place for Kids, you can visit them on Facebook or on the web at judysplace.org. Reporting from Pikeville for EKB News, I'm Sean Allen.